Well, it happened. People sent death threats and doxxed a little girl over politics. The young girl called Mini AOC, who mocked Congresswoman Ocasio-Cortez, has pulled all of her social media accounts due to death threats to her family. Ava will not be doing any more Mini AOC content. The left's harassment and death threats have gone too far for our family. We have been getting calls on our personal phone numbers. For our safety and for our child's safety, we deleted all Mini AOC accounts. Personally, I don't believe children should be involved in politics at all. But the reason it was so popular and funny is because an eight-year-old's impression of AOC was wildly accurate. What an amazing view of the Pacific Ocean they had. But literally, if President Trump built his border wall, you can say goodbye to those ocean views. We don't need a wall on America's southern border. We need a wall on Mexico's northern border. And we're like, the world is going to end in 12 years if we don't address climate change. And the funny thing is, this little girl isn't even taking it poorly. They started to go fund me to donate to a children's hospital. Why you ask? Why wouldn't they just keep the money for themselves considering they were bullied into stopping what they were doing? We're fortunate enough not to be hurting financially like so many others, and Ava will always be well taken care of, including her education. Not to mention college will be free soon and the earth will end by her junior year. Come on, that's funny. But they're using threats or doxing or violence. I think it would be great to condemn the use of children for all pushing of political and cultural campaigning. If only there was something else. Some sort of movement that is shamelessly using children to normalize a culturally insignificant portion of society. Surely we could all come together and condemn it. Hmm, can't think of anything. Can you feel the tension in the air right now? I know I can. I can feel it all the way down in my plums. All the school children are lining up to put them in the sack lunches.